My name is uh, Neil Armstrong. I'm the assistant kennel manager here at Manchester Dog Soul. Um, it's Christmas Day. What, what have you been up to? What time did you get up? Uh, well, usually the day starts as normal for myself because I've got dogs at home, so obviously I need to sort them out before I come to work. Um, the day here usually starts with obviously getting on site, um, getting all the staff in, um, and literally going around, um, sorting the dogs out, feeding them, giving them medication. Uh, we have quite a lot of dog walkers which come up on Christmas morning um, to take these dogs for a walk. Um, after, so what generally happens is they all have um, the Christmas lunch. Uh, yes, they do all get chicken and turkey and um, Yorkshire puddings and all the trimmings is what you would normally get on Christmas Day. Uh, so they all sit down and have a, you know, I say sit down, they all have that in their kennels. Um, and once they've had that, then what the staff generally do is go around with presents for all the dogs to open on Christmas. Um, so yeah, it's pretty much like obviously having kids at home really, to be fair. Um, yeah, so the dogs end up with lots of presents, um, lovely food, and then we try and get, get, get the staff away a little bit earlier so they can enjoy Christmas with their families. And they've all got Christmas stockings, so they generally get filled as well by the public um, in the run up towards today. Uh, the atmosphere is really good. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's really good to see so many uh, volunteers that have come to walk the dogs on Christmas Day. Um, so, yeah, it's been really good. We occasionally get strays coming in. Um, I mean, we generally take up until 12 o'clock off the local councils uh, with stray dogs. Um, but if a member of the public does turn up because they found a stray dog, then we would never refuse it or you know, turn it away, really. Um, what's it like seeing the long time residents on Christmas um, Day? The ones that have been here a it's, while? It's difficult, it really is. I mean, because to be fair, you know, they shouldn't be here, they should be in loving homes. Um, but we try and provide the best care we possibly can for them. What advice would you give to anybody thinking about adopting a dog as a present on Christmas Day? Adopting a dog just purely for Christmas is not the best idea. Um, a dog really is for life, it's not just for Christmas. We generally say think before anything um, because it's a lifelong commitment, you know, it's, it's not just that one day. Um, you know, the dog is, uh, you, you know, you get the dog, you, you take the dog on with the problems, you work through the problems. There's no such thing as a perfect dog, it's how they're trained.